Yo guys, it's been a man. I don't think I have filmed for my YouTube channel in maybe three weeks. It's just been a harrowing three weeks. But I'm back. I'm doing my vegan cleanse. And after, I guess it's been three days now, I kind of feel like I have some of my energy back. So anyway, I'm here to talk to you. Speaking of cleansing, um, I want to talk to you about Shaf. New, clean, natural skincare from my friends up north in Canada. Yes, I'm here to talk all about Shaf. And yes, it's pronounced Shaf. You see, Shaf rhymes with. Um, Anyway, I posted up today on my blog uh, at skincarma.com, so be sure to head over there and um, read the entire piece, the whole in-depth review of the brand and each of the products, including uh, full inkies um, and uh, purchase links, all of it. So, Chef, clean, natural skincare from Canada. I believe they're based in Toronto, but don't quote me. Um, I've certainly had my share of good times in Canada, long three-day weekends for my birthday, for Christmas, for New Year's. I love Montreal in particular. Um, and in fact, I'm just going to come right out and say it. Y'all can diss me in the comments, whatever you want to do. But Montreal bagels are better than New York bagels. I'm dead serious about that. New York bagels are super thick. Like one bagel and you're done eating for the week. Uh, Montreal bagels are a little more delicate. Um, and because they're not as doughy, they're also, uh, they can, they're also kind of crunchier, I guess. Um, just, just take my word for it. I've eaten my share of bagels in my day. But anyway, so Shaft based in Toronto. Yes, correct. Someone can correct me if I'm wrong. Um, but anyway, let me just like jump right into it. So they launched with these three products, a shave cream, a facial cleanser, and a moisturizer. This moisturizer is the bomb. Um, they have since in the last, I don't know, two weeks or so, introduced, uh, I believe, three or four more products. And you can check those out. Uh, again, just head over to the blog, skincarma.com. The links are there and uh, you can see what's up. This moisturizer. It's amazing. First of all, it's silicone free, it's microplastic free, it's uh, synthetic fragrance free, there's no essential oils, there's no parabens, there's no blah. It's a real, this is like super clean, like ultra clean. No silicones, like come on now. I believe if I remember correct, correctly, again, the juice cleanse, um, it's 45 bucks. It's loaded with good for skin ingredients. There's jojoba oil in here. There's grapeseed oil in here. There's a uh, 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 hemp hemp seed oil. Um, I talk about this in the blog. The difference between uh, CBD or can can cannabidiol and hemp seed both come from the hemp or cannabis plant. But hemp seed oil, you have to think of more like a really good nourishing uh, non fragrant plant oil uh, up there with Oregon. Uh, rose hip seed, uh, squalane, like a really good replenishing biocompatible oil. Hemp seed oil, in fact, ha is super rich in um, omega fatty acids. Um, look, at, I mean, it just, it's just amazing. It's light, it's fluffy, it massages right in uh, because there's no silicones to pad the skin surface silicones that don't penetrate and make you think that your skin is plump and nourished and soft and cushiony and all of that crap. Uh, this stuff just goes right in where it needs to go. Um, hemp seed oil, omega fatty acids, vitamins, minerals. It's a terrific option and I'm so excited. Yes, it's a trendy ingredient. Who cares? It's a trendy ingredient that really does good things for the skin. What's really notable about this product is not that it contains hemp seed oil. Who cares? Hemp seed oil is in a lot of things. Um, but that it contains, at very high level, 
two uh, anti-aging peptides. One of them is called palmitoyl tetrapeptide 7, and palmitoyl uh, tetrapeptide 7 has skin soothing properties. It can help to soothe irritation. So this is honestly one of the best moisturizers for sensitive skin, for normal skin, oily skin, not too oily because it's got, it's got the oils in it. Um, dry skin, it's just all around a terrific moisturizer. If you're looking for something all natural, if you're looking for something superbly clean, like the ultimate level of clean, this stuff is it, you can't go wrong. 45 bucks, yes. Uh, next is the, the Shaft Facial Cleanser. I love this stuff. It's, uh, it's got only 11 ingredients. It's a really tight uh, inky list. Um, and so 11 ingredients, but it's all good for skin ingredients. There's no fillers, there's no kind of crap. Uh, I, there are three cleansers that I really love. I love a cleansing oil. That's probably my favorite kind of cleanser. I love an enzymatic cleansing powder and I love like a cleansing milk or a milky cleanser. Look at this. You see? It's made with um, coconut oil. Coconut oil, coconut oil derived surfactants. And watch. See how it barely suds? This stuff is so good for your skin. Look, the more I do it, it barely suds. Non-stripping, again, there's only 11 ingredients, it's all natural. It's got aloe in it, it's got chamomile in it, it's got uh, coconut oil, obviously, in it. Um, and it's just really good for skin. If I remember correctly, it's 40 bucks. Don't quote me, head over to the blog. Really good stuff if you're looking for a super gentle cleanser. If you have irritated skin, uh, inflamed skin, if you just have skin, this is a terrific cleanser. It's not gonna do any kind of, uh, any kind of mischief. There won't be any irritation whatsoever. It's just a good, good, clean cleanser. I have used this as my only, uh, in, only step in my double cleanse. It works just fine. My skin feels completely cleared away. Um, I do tend to uh, really enjoy a cleansing oil in the late afternoon though, like right about now, come to think of it, um, to remove sunscreen and makeup. If you wear makeup, uh, you want to obviously use a cleansing oil or a makeup remover first. Um, but first thing in the morning, second cleanse, before bed, whatever. Good, good, good stuff in here. And last, that I want to highlight of the three products in the uh, initial launch of Shaft is the shave cream. Okay, I detest, I can't stress it enough, I detest shaving. Like, really, it's the worst thing. So today, I didn't shave obviously because I have a bit of a beard as you can see. Tomorrow is shave day because I shaved yesterday. Um, right? I don't remember, it's all a blur. Um, but if my, sha if my beard, if I stick to an every other day shave routine, I'm good. If I wait three days, it's hell. My beard gets too thick and I actually get ingrown hairs and, and uh, I break out. And then I need to pop a zit sticker on. So, shaft shave cream. 14 ingredients in this baby. It's 25 bucks, uh, similar to the other two. It's got coconut oil in it. It's got aloe, but it also has something called elantoin. Elantoin is a biocompatible skin soothing, uh, skin conditioning active that's derived from uh, urea. Really good for skin. It's like a, think of it as a power soother. And it's actually a really smart addition uh, to a shave cream to help um, calm down irritation post shave. Um, good stuff. I have had no irritation whatsoever from this. Um, I wouldn't risk waiting three or four days. Three days might be pushing it, right? Um, but look at this. It's all natural, guys. It's an all natural shave cream. And it smells like absolutely nothing because there's no essential oils. There's no essential oils, there's no synthetic fragrance, there's no non-synthetic fragrance. What's a non-synthetic fragrance? Um, it's just good stuff, all of this. Like it's, 
I love that it's white because it's all pure, pure, good, pro skin health stuff. Love Shaft. You guys really nailed it. I'm so excited to, to uh, share this brand, guys. And guess what? Of course, there's a giveaway. Yes, go to SkinKarma.com. You uh, can enter to win all three of these products. How much do they come to? I think it's about 110 bucks. Um, and you can try Shaft for yourself. Compliments of Shaft and Skin Karma. All right? Back to my juice cleanse. Keeping it clean, keeping it real. Catch you guys later.